Hi, this is Leslie. In this video, we will look at how to generate a merge document in Reserve Cloud in order to preview it or download it or print it, as well as how to send a merge document as an email attachment. I'm going to go ahead and jump into our events module and open up an event I already have in the system by double clicking on it. I'm going to make an assumption here that we've entered our event. We've possibly even added services to our event. And now we simply want to generate some kind of a merge document. So I'm going to scroll down here to the communication history area. This is where I can generate an event document simply by clicking on this button. A list of my merge documents will be here for me and I can simply click on the column heading to resort if I need to easily find that document. By clicking the checkbox, I indicate that's the one that I want to take a look at. By default, we do this in a PDF format. However, I could also do it in a Word format if I preferred. Once I've clicked the sample that I want and it's in the format that I want, I can simply click Generate Documents. And depending on your browser, the document may either open or be available somewhere on your screen so that you could then preview it. Once I bring it up, I could also, of course, download it or print it. I'm going to go ahead and exit out of my preview. And I'm just going to click Done to exit my Generate Documents area. Now let's take a look at how to email our customer and possibly attach a merge document if desired. As I scroll down again, it's here in this communication history area, except for this time I'm going to click on Send Event Email. Because I'm not utilizing one of our lifecycle steps, Reserve's not sure exactly which email template to present me with, so it allows me to select simply by clicking Choose Email, I'll select the template that I want. It's listed here, and I can click my mouse in the body of it if I choose to edit it in any way. Near the bottom, this is where I can attach documents. My merge documents are listed here again under Generate Documents. I click the button. I click the document that I want to attach. I'll click the words Generate Document here on the button. And that is generating itself as a PDF to attach in my email. Once that attachment is visible, I can still preview it simply by clicking on the link here and it'll bring up that document again so that I can preview it prior to sending. Once I'm ready to send it, I can go ahead and click the send email button. Prior to sending, you may want to ask yourself, do I want to save this specific document as it looks right now in history? If I do, I can simply check this box. That will save that document in history for my future reference. Now I'll go ahead and hit send email and off that email will go to my guest. The communication history section down here near the bottom is going to be updated with any documents that are generated as well as any emails that are sent. Further, with emails, the status column will change as it goes from sent to delivered to opened. If your contact replies to your email, it will go not only to your normal email tool, but a copy of it will also shoot back into here into the communication history. Thanks for watching. That was our video on how to generate documents as well as how to send emails in Reserve Cloud.